Hi, I'm Siggy, welcome we'll back once again to another slice of my YouTube heaven. There's me brother Tony who doesn't want to be on the video. And in the background, hiding behind us somewhere, like a freak that he is, is Robbie by Polar Bear. We are at Birmingham, we have been to Eurogamer, and he's been me off, fuck off you, you bastard. He's been me off, if we have piss off. We have done day one of Eurogamer. Hi, friend, I didn't see that. <laughs> and this is the kind of mood we're in. Cues, games, lots of weird, will you fuck off? Lots of weird people dressed up in very strange kind of cosplayers. This is the true description <laughs> of Eurogamer. Um, lots of games, good ones, really, really good games to play. Some rather strange ones and lots and lots of indie stuff, more indie stuff than I actually thought. You can tell this is a, a really serious con, can't you? Uh, but, there you go, and I'm gonna put you there. Stop. I'm gonna piss off. <laughs> really, honestly, piss off. No, we'll start off. Um, <laughs> an hour's worth of a queue. I'm not starting again. Fuck it. Uh, an hour's worth of a queue to get in. Lots of people waiting for it. Good atmosphere. Quite easy to get to. It was fun. We started, walked straight in, seen all these massive displays. And what are we going to do? Black Ops 3. <laughs> Strangely. We ignored everything. He camped on. I did camp hard, really. Stay in the corner. At, at 35 for 10, I camped I really don't care. Well, when we got Black Ops 3, it was a good setup. It was fun. It was quick. It was a good laugh. It started off on the good foot. That's when we realised we really should have went to the Battlefront queue first, because the Battlefront queue was ridiculous. Ridiculous all day. We didn't even bother joining it. It was wrapped around most of each extra half the time. Uh, from Black Ops 3, we went down to Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed, yes. A great game. No. Oh. Yeah. Not my cup of tea. Not my brother's cup of tea. That was. It's yeah, a slow, clunky kind boat. of thing. I couldn't, I couldn't even get up a boat. I don't even. Who presses a trigger and a button to jump? That's Not a this stupid setup. Stuck. Just because you complete and you're the only person to do it in the whole line, as you've politely reminded us several thousand times. It looks nice. It plays nice. I also beat on Street Fighter and people. Just to unplug the controller. <laughs> Cheating. Um, yes, he did base on FIFA though. I kind of rage really quit on FIFA and embarrassed myself quite massively. I don't really care. I don't like FIFA. I can't play it. Um, it was fun. It was a good laugh. A lot of cues, which we knew were coming in... The one queue that almost killed it and kind of spoiled it to a certain degree was the division. Two fucking hours in a queue to play a game for three minutes. Five, five, ten. Nah, it was three minutes. I had to respawn that much. It took that long for us to get back in the game. Um, a decent looking game. A bit greeny, a bit sort of edgy and... A bit yeah. shit. Yeah, a bit shit is probably the word I'm looking for. Um, it didn't play too bad, but the guy who was putting like a, a team of three against a three against a three on a big cube. Um, we were all together. He came on, he goes, hi, can you hear us in the headset? It was all right, brilliant, right, okay, have a little run around for 30 seconds and you can find out what your gun is. Okay, right, I had a shotgun, blah, blah, blah. And then that was all he said. There's an objective in the corner, and then he just shut up for the next three and a half minutes. We didn't have a clue who we were shooting. We didn't know what we were meant to be doing. Apart from my brother, who kind of figured out, I mean... We just ran around like tits, basically, and died a lot. It wasn't fun. It's it's not a game I'm really looking forward to. I might pick it up, might play it. I'm not too sure. Yeah, this face. I was born with this face. I've always got it. I mean, I can't help it at all. Um, tomorrow it's going to be a slightly different setup. We're going to go straight in. We're going to go straight to the battlefront. I want to try and get on that if we can. Uh, we've got Halo Five coming up. We have got Rainbow Six coming up. We've also got what's the other one? The big one. It's more fun to watch a struggle. No, it's not. Just cause, yeah. Just cause, yes. We've got that in play as well. There's there's a good six or seven big AAA titles we want to play. We will get to them. I'm going to try, if I can, if Robbie doesn't follow us around and take the piss out of us, and do a live com from EGX, even though they don't let you, really. But I'm still going to do one. They, they do, you just look like a giant. Yes, yeah, so I just look like a twat with a fake selfie stick with a little oxygen on. Um, I will do them. I will try and get some commentary in there. I'll try and give you a little bit of sneak footage if I can get away with it. But yes, you're a game uh, day one. Pretty good. Quite enjoyed it. Division. Uh, oh, Plants vs. Zombies. Awesome. Proper awesome. Really enjoyed that one. Um, the queue was about 10 people long as well, which was fantastic. You can just jump on it all the time. Um, we did sort of chase Snipe and Raccoon around all the time. Still haven't seen him. He's there somewhere. He's probably still there. And so you chased him around. Uh, yes, I chased him around. I'd like to see him. He didn't get. Uh, we did see Tav. 
and that was quite nice. Um, and lots of cosplayers in strange outfits who didn't play any games, which I can't see the point of at a gaming convention. But uh, I'll be sneaky. I shall catch you next time. Thank you very much. Bye.